Hello, and welcome back to Watch the Chaotic. It's awesome you're here. And welcome back to more of Banished. And, well, we, we've done quite a lot in a previous episode. A lot of people are also kind of passing away. Our vendor, well, we definitely need all oh, herb. Uh, no, we don't really need a herbalist right now. Brewer, we don't need that just yet. We really have to make sure that we can uh, keep our uh, teachers. So we now have our quarry. We've got a iron mine. We are planning to get a tunnel over here and maybe start another village or neighborhood over there. And we've been doing quite a lot of things. But besides that, we... Uh, our first generation of settlers is kind of passing away now, which is not that great. So... We just really have to hope that we can get some nomads, because there's our town hall. And I, I assume we will get a notification about it as well. But so far so good, the happiness is going down a little bit. But I'm sure that we can fix that as well. So if we expand our road over here to go past the church, we can have a few more houses on this side as well. That's we're down to 21 adults. We are still getting uh, kids and everything, so that's okay. And then our tavern is almost built. It's just... It's, it's taking its own sweet time. We're still doing good on food, so we have nothing to worry on that. We've got some orchards set up, pastures. Oh, we have a sheep over here. Actually, we don't have the sheep anymore. It probably just passed away, I think. Basically, it says zero of six. In that case, let's remove that profession. And let's just stop that barn as well. Next time, we really need to buy more animals. I really don't know why I actually decided to only get one. We don't have a lot of stone stored. We're actually also still trying to uh, upgrade this house. Oh, and who grew up? Because we now suddenly have another laborer. Mm, I think we'll keep it as two laborers because we definitely need to continue on gathering stone. And we are gathering a fair amount from over here. But right now our walking distances are also getting longer. So... I think that's... Nope, yeah, exactly. We don't need that part over there. I hope that as soon as we get some nomads, we can also get our quarry up and running. That would be useful. I get a path along here at some point. And let's hope that our... Ooh, Lemon was born. Let's hope that the next uh, trader or merchant will also get something nice. 8 out of 15 graves. Maybe you have to expand the graveyard on this side as well. This wasn't really a good place for a graveyard. It's just this hill over there. Martini has become a student. And our tavern is almost completed. Just look at all the barrels and everything. Even on the inside, that's quite nice. And that guy just uh, walks right through the tavern. Oh, one builder, two laborers. We're getting there. Just look at the amount of firewood though. Maybe we can set the limit back to a thousand. Just so that this person, oh, once it reaches its limit, actually starts doing things like a laborer needs to do. But blacksmith is still working on a hundred tools. We can... Oops, not zero. That's a two less. Let's reduce that to 50. And our tailor is waiting for materials. That's just the height goes. Hmm. And we might need to increase the amount of hunters. Beryl has died of old age, but Ernesto replaced Beryl as a farmer. 
Our food is it's decent, but I don't really want to reduce any more people in regards of uh, food collection. But at least we should have a few more people just roaming around and collecting things. Just look at this lush forest over here. That's what I'm trying to do with this forester as well. The amount of logs is also set to a thousand. So that's all fine. Another tree fell over there. So let's speed things up a little bit. Dwig was born. We still don't have any nomads. So stone, we're really low. But if we look at anything else, our uses of food, we basically have enough for well, a bit more than two years. So if we look at that, is there anything that we can really reduce? Hmm. I, I don't really... No, let's let's not think about it. However, let's see, what can we do? We don't have apples. Berries, jail. Uh, inventory, what do we have a lot of? We have zero berries. Peppers, chicken, herbs. Actually, we do have quite an, an amount of apples. Yep, we're going to make ale, apple ale. Plum and wheat. And the alcohol limit, 500 sounds quite a lot, but I think it's fine. Semni has become a laborer, and I think he's now working, or she, is now working at the tavern over there. Lien has become a student. And how is her church going? Still waiting on some stone. Uh, over here, this just needs to be built. And then I just want to get actually this forest set to just plant a few more trees, just so we have some more forest over here. And then once that's done, we can remove the forester. So it's really a temporary one. This one we will still use for collecting wood. But then this one, just because this is quite a lot of barren land and we do have a hunting cabin here and a herbalist, I think it just looks nicer like that. The orchards. Let's just pause these actually because there's nobody working over there. At least we can get the walnuts and apples going. Especially the apples since we're now also making ale out of that. Oh, and we actually already have 110 barrels of ale. Leavenborn, Stir is now working as a laborer. Oh, things are moving. And it's been a while since we've not seen a merchant. And still no nomads. I think they are uh, just not aware that we're... Uh, that we're here. I actually even have a few people living alone in a house. Wow, actually quite a lot. So we definitely need to... Uh, don't need to build any new houses. Happiness is going low, but I don't really think we can see why. Everyone is clothed, everyone is educated, so that's good. 16 homes, 12 families. So let's see. And then our forester is done, so we will not say cut, we will just say that you can plant. And that should slowly get things going. At least to get this area nice and lush. Maybe we can even get a gatherer over here. So the older the forest, the more well, mushrooms and berries and things you get around there. 
But that's uh, for when we actually need uh, more food. The surf of stone is low again. Well, we are still collecting, I suppose. Let's just... Uh... Nope, we're still marking all these bits as... For collection. Just look at the forest, it's just... We have reached the maximum amount of logs for so long that just the uh, forest really keeps growing. It looks really good though. Now we can say to collect some stone over here. We are actually doing it partly already. There we go. And is there any progress on our church? Ooh, actually there is. We just need to wait until it's built now. Awesome. But we oh, really need some extra stone. I think I'll just increase the amount of builders by one. That shouldn't be too big of an issue. Oh, and over here we are upgrading our house now. And just, we have so many people just live on actually 73 years old. That one is um, probably not going to stay here for long anymore. Over here. How oh, it's our. We actually we do have quite a lot of iron right now. So let's just cancel the collection of iron over here. I do want to collect them over there. Also cancel over there, but we want to collect the stone. This so hopefully our laborers are focusing on the right thing to do. Woodcutter died of old age and it's replaced. Gatherer died of old place. Alt aids was is replaced. Wow. And no merchant for a while now. No merchants, no nomads. We're quite alone in this world. So let's see where else could we because this is quite the end of the map. We do have a huge area over here to expand to. I think this is such a nice area to actually get something. So if we expand over here and go there, but this really needs its own economy. But we can also have a small area over there, across the river over here. Martini became an adult and is working as a laborer. Oh. We are still growing up. We have four babies, of four children now, two students. And the church is almost there. Nellis was born. So let's see, because after the chapel, I keep calling it a church, but it's a chapel. Once that's built, what else can we build? Maybe the hospital? The court also needs people to work there. We can also start working on the tunnel. That might be a good one. The tunnel also needs quite a lot of stone though. I'll look at the deer over here. Come on, we want the merchant. Let's. I do want to have some livestock again. Livestock or nomads. Where is that going at 10 times speed? Oh, but would you look at that? There we go. All the stone is getting hammered in. Ninety percent complete. Ninety-two. Arl was born. So we're getting a bit of a population boom again soon. And a merchant arrived at our trading post. Well, let's have a look. Leather. Oh no, that's one of the things we don't really need. Oh, So we can also have the custom orders. Hmm. Like stone or something, but... Auto purchase. 
No, I don't want to auto-purchase things. I think that's just... Um, if you don't keep an eye on that, it's gonna get risky. And any nomads? Nope. Although I, I'm pretty sure you'll get a notification for that. And there we go, our church is built. Wow. Our chapel, I mean. It looks so nice and it's snow covered. That's a good looking church. And... Oh, Rudolphus just became an adult. Oh no, Bessie the Hunter died during childbirth. That's a new message that I've seen there. But now at least our church is up and running and we have 28 members over there. And it's immediately increasing our happiness. The cemetery is getting full. Oh boy. Should we just expand on the side over there for the cemetery or cross the road and get one? Oh, that actually is not a bad idea. We cross here and have a cemetery on this side. Let's have a look. So, expand the path over here and then get a bridge here. And let's just extend this then. I still like to double the paths. And where is our cemetery? Let's see. So from here, how far can we extend this? Over to there. 68 stone though. It's better to get started on that then. And wow, our wooden bridge is almost built. Nextly, we do have a serious good amount of stone currently. Wow. So we're down to 20 at all. It's slowly going down though. We have a house over here. A lot of people getting old. I just really hope that uh, we will be able to keep this up. Let's reduce our amount of foresters. I think that's not a bad thing. Hmm. Do I guess become a student? But what? Are we currently still building? I think only just a cemetery. That's the kind of thing we really need. This is now 13 out of the... I wonder if, if at some point also the graves get emptied again. Um, that's a bit spooky. But so far, we are still good on our uh, storage. Let's just start building the hospital as well. And you know what? Let's also just unpause this. We do have a fair amount of building projects that we can currently pick up. Oh, this is going over here. Wow, look at that. All these new trees are getting built. Let's extend the road over there. I don't want to start working on stone roads just yet until we actually have the quarry up and running. Because I'm afraid that otherwise we will uh, just run out of well, all the stone possible. And look at this lush forest. You know what, I think I will just uh, shut this one down for a moment. No, actually no, you keep on hunting, that's fine. This one can keep on running. And this one is only planting anyway. 
the woodcutter died of old age. Well, technically we... Mm, should we just reduce this to, say, 500? Then we don't really need a uh, woodcutter for a long time. Lieni has become an adult and is working as a laborer. I think they are working on the tunnel already. Look at them go. Just needs to be built now. So as soon as you actually have like things in storage, it, it, things go quickly. Over here, well, 74 items need to be removed. But they're well on their way. Nothing to complain. And a fair amount of uh, stone over here as well. See, there we go. And I wonder if they actually leave the stone behind because that's something that they anyway need to build over here. That might be a smart move, actually. Although the counter of items to be removed does not really go up. Ellie was born. So we, we, are getting, uh, we are getting a fair amount of kids again. No, it looks like they're removing all the stone. And he received an award. Build a town that has at least one of every building. Oh, there we go. It has our hospital is finished. You know what? Let's get someone working over there. That's an interesting looking... F oh, look at the cross over there. That's a nice thing. Huh. Not too big. A, a town hall compared to the hospital is huge. Gusta born. Queen is born. What? No nomads just yet. I wonder what we can do to increase um, the chances of getting nomads. Is there anything that you can do? Probably not. Look at this. Oh, our population. It is going up just a bit again. Children are definitely go going up. We have 12 wool. Wow. Our health has dropped slightly. But everyone is still clothed, so that's good. We, uh, that's that's important. And we're missing a bit of road over there. There we go. And this one is... Ooh, 14 out of 15. And wow, our tunnel is done. Nice. So we now have the option to also start gathering things on this side if we really need it. But currently with over 100 stone, we're okay for a bit. Actually, if we just look at... Oops, this. Are you... No, you're really not collecting anything. So... With the laborers not really doing much, I want to set up this part again to just collect, uh, collect the iron. Leth has become a student. And Rihanna was born. Oh, Rianne. Not Rihanna. 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 So I kind of would like to build more houses, but it, it's really not useful right now. There, well, we don't... I'm, I'm pretty sure some houses are vacant. However, maybe in that case we can just set these up to actually uh, get upgraded. Gasol. Nobody should be moving to the boarding. Oh, oh actually they do. There are a few houses now. Uh... Well, that's okay. We currently don't have any laborers anymore. However, I think I'm okay with that, considering that, um, well, our foresters are basically done. Our woodcutter isn't really doing much. So, 19 adults, 5 students, and 
23 adults, zero students, and five children. Wow, that suddenly went up. But the teacher died of old age and there's nobody to replace, but now that is, and we definitely need it. I think that's why all the students suddenly became adults. So now we probably have a few uneducated adults. But that's okay. It, it's fine. It's not too big of a deal. So we have three laborers. Um, let's get one herbalist up and running again. Just uh, We have 109 medicine stored. See, that's herbs. So does the hospital convert things to medicine then? And we just need a bit more stone over there. Arl has become a student again. Our reserve of stone is getting low. So now we have built one of every building. Wow. Let's collect some stone on this side. We really need our... Uh, number of people going up and that, that's the tricky part of this game you really need to plan so far ahead well not only with buildings but also actually with your people nobody in the boarding house i assume well no we're still working on these houses we are probably just kind of running uh dry on stone And that bit of road should not be there. There we go. And a merchant arrived. Beacons. Uh, no, we have enough food. But uh, tell some nomads that they can come to us, please. Down to 20 adults, but we have 6 children. And a... Really huge cemetery right now. Which I think we really need because, well, that one is, yep, that one is full. But we've gone through a few seasons and no nomads in sight. So is that something... Well, this is the edge of the map. So I assume they can just come from wherever. The teacher? Oh no, not again. Farmer died of old age. Down to 19. Well, one out of 112 graves. So th th this will be uh, this will sustain for a little bit. Let's just collect the iron and stone that's around here, just to uh, you know, make it look a bit more presentable. Our food is slowly going down. So is our firewood, but so is the amount of people. Thing of season 21, year 21. Look at this insanely thick and lush forest. Wow. And we've been also planning a stone house over here and a hunting cabin over there, but uh, that's uh, not gonna be needed for uh, a long time. We can collect our stone and iron from here if we really need it. These houses are getting completed. Holly was born. As long as we still get them born messages, things will be okay. And if we get some nomads, we can usually get around 10 nomads, something like that. So that's a fair amount. 
I think I will leave it here for now. I might just let the game run a little bit in the background and see if we can uh, get some more people so we can actually start expanding our town. Probably down here. And in the future, all the way down here as well. So for now, I'd like to thank you for watching. Please leave a comment and a like. Subscribe if you haven't done so. And I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.